my personal statement. Um, did you like get what I was trying to say? Like, did was it there? Um, because I felt like it was such a new experience for me to write that a personal statement because I never read anything like that, and it was like, how am I showing instead of telling? Am I like really? Um, are people gonna understand what I was trying to say and what what what's what come off as showing in the in the actual personal statement? Sure. Yeah, I think you actually did a better job than most statements I read. To be honest, I think that <laughs> you you kept it very real. You were focused on telling the story and including lots of details. Like you really brought us to that moment in time. Exactly. And you did the same for the diversity statement, by the way, which was really nice to see. So I think you're definitely on the right track with both of these. Um, thank you so much. Yeah, I really wanted people to um, feel like they were there and kind of understanding what I was going through that moment because um, it, it, those those two moments were very big moments in my life where, you know, I had to do something or I realized that, that I was different, you know, th all the different things that were going on that I feel like um, if people kind of understand that, then they'll get me, you know, they'll get the whole idea. Right, right. So I loved almost all of the personal statement. I think the one area where it went a little bit off to me was when you suddenly th threw in talking about like the reading program. I think the reading program is, is a great work to be involved in, mm -hmm. but to me, it didn't seem quite closely tied enough to the other okay. topics covered in the statement itself. Thanks for tuning into the show. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already to be notified of new episodes as I release them. And feel free to reach out if you need anything at all as you move forward with your prep. I'm happy to help however I can. In the meantime, I wish you all the best and take care.